So to solve this one, um, I'm going to look at what I have. A boat can travel nine miles per hour in still water. So the boat speed on its own is nine. Um, five hours to travel upstream, four trails. So let me keep track of what I know. I got upstream and downstream. And I know some things about the time. So traveling upstream, it takes five hours. Traveling uh, downstream, it takes four hours. Let me get at some rates. What's the speed of the current? I don't know that. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to let that be X. So speed of current is X. So I know something about time. So let me think about the rate. So as the boat is going upstream, so the boat's going upstream, the current's going to be pushing back against it. So it can go at 9 miles per hour, but the current's going to be coming back at X. So the rate would be uh, upstream would be 9 minus X. And as, the, as it's going downstream, 9, and then the current would, would push it, x. So the rate going downstream would be 9 plus x. And notice that it went the same amount. It went upstream and then downstream, so the distance is the same. So this distance equals that distance. And I know that distance is rate times time. So rate times time, so 5 times 9 minus x. This one would be... 4 times 9 plus x, and those distances are the same. So 5 times 9 minus x should equal 4 times 9 plus x. We can just solve that, distribute that in. 45 minus 5x equals 36 plus 4x. Uh, add 5x to both sides. Subtract 36 from both sides. Uh, 45. <clears throat> so this gives me a 9x over here. And then if I look over here, uh, 45 minus 36 is 9, divide by 9, x is 1, so the speed of the current is 1 miles per hour.